been uh, some time now since you played DePaul. What do you make of their progress since last you saw them? Well, I, mean, I think they have a really talented team. I think they um, you know, have a team that has one of the most explosive scorers in our league in Max Struess, uh, a point guard who sort of assumed those duties and maybe didn't necessarily know he was going to be the point at the beginning of the year in Eli Kane, but a guy that um, projects a lot of uh, poise from the point guard position, great size. And then um, Marn March is, is a terrific post, a guy that can score it over either shoulder. He's big. And so uh, they've played much better basketball over the last four or five games. Um, and this is coming from a, a team that almost got beat by them the first time. So yeah. we got our work cut out for us uh, on Saturday. Are you impressed with what Coach Slato has done with that program over the course of this year? I am. When, they, when he first took over, um, you know, they had a team that, quite honestly, wasn't very good. Yeah. And the, the talent that he's been able to um, bring in, I think the togetherness, how hard they play. Um, you know, they've given some teams, Villanova, fits. So we, like I said, we've got our work, work cut out for us, and uh, we better make sure we're ready to go 11 a.m. Central time. Max had, um, he had himself a night here when yeah. you guys played the ball. How would you like to play him? Well, we got, we got to do a better right? job of, uh, number one, it started with our offense. We, we put them out in transition. He runs to the three-point line. Yeah. Um, he has the green light and has the ability to, um, you know, shoot it from deep. And then in the half court, we lost him on a few uh, stagger screens. I mean, they run him off several baseline screens. And, you know, he only needs a fraction of an inch to get the shot off. He has great size and a quick release. So uh, we've got to be much more locked in. It was the first time our guys had really seen uh, him play. And so hopefully we got a deep respect after watching him give us 33 the first time around. Yeah, obviously, you take nothing for granted in the Big East on a, on a day in, day out basis. You would obviously expect to get a great game from DePaul, even though they're low down in the season. Yeah, I mean, it's their senior day. It's senior, it's senior day. Um, it's an opportunity for them to put a feather in their cap and, um, you know, knock us, knock us down a peg. And uh, so I'm sure that they're going to be ready. They were the first time we played them. We were fortunate enough to win. We have to be much better on Saturday. There was a heck of a party on this court last night. There is no evidence of that party having taken place right now. Was that by design? Uh, I don't know. You know, I think uh, we talked about it a lot with our team in the locker room. And uh, there, there's so much more that we want to do. But we can say all that. It's really about uh, being that and, and going out and proving that. And I hope we play, um, you know, the games remaining with a chip on our shoulder. Um, and that starts on Saturday. Where did the trophy the night last I, honestly, I don't know. I don't know. You'd probably have to ask Tom Iser. He might have been the keeper of the trophy. <laughs>